All right. Yeah, let's get let's get that happening. Hopefully we can do it today. All right, Travis is hauling the last of that here. And he's having a meal. And he's going to rest. All right, I guess we're doing it tomorrow. Yeah, we're doing it tomorrow. Who is Major Break? It's Travis. Yeah. I should actually now go and set Lim Hansen to do some cleaning. Yep. Because quite a few of the moods that have been dropping here are a result of ugly environment. So Lim Hansen can definitely fix that up for us. Oh, what's happening? We have a raid. We have a raid and we have turrets that aren't set up. Okay, they want to use sappers, which means that they're attacking immediately. And it's a reasonably large group. Alright. Can I build some extra turrets here in time? Do we have any steel actually in our stockpile? We don't. So all of our steel is probably outside. Yeah. Um, who's awake or not in a terrible mood who can construct? Um, Jay can't really construct. Yeah, Beardy's asleep. I don't think we can do these anyway. Yeah, I don't. Should we just take this on in here? Or try to take this on in here? <sighs> I guess that's what we're going to do. Alright, let's get this flicked. Let's get this flicked. Alright, your mood is going to be alright when you wake up, so... Yeah. Let's get you guys up. Okay, Beardy obviously can't. Violent. You guys are armed. You have... You're a brawler. Alright, everyone is armed. So, up, 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 up. Come out to the front. And Travis, you can flick the switch. And come out here. How are our guys doing? They're not attacking yet? <laughs> okay. They're using sappers. They're using sappers. Is this because, like, we have a home zone... ...somewhere near here? I don't know. It feels to me like the AI is, like, trying to be too smart. It's like trying to think about too many things. I don't know. Like, previously... Oh, this guy's got a Fallout helmet on. And so does this guy. He's got the T-45B power armor helmet. Yeah. Sick. We're going to get some uh, some power armor helmets out of this. We have everyone recruited. So let's run them down here. Or should we actually unrecruit them? And let them go get a meal or something? Let's actually do that. If they need it. You're going to haul steel to that. Actually, that's actually not a bad idea. So maybe we'll have a chance to set up some turrets. And in fact, why don't we reinstall you there. And reinstall you over here. Alright. Which turret is Travis going to do? It doesn't actually tell me. Okay, we'll just keep an eye on this. Make sure he doesn't get too close to these guys. Alright, which turret are you going to? You're going to this one. So I'll cancel that. Emre is going to rest. On your way back, Emre, you can probably take that turret for me. So do that, please. 
All right. And how are our sappers doing? They're sapping away. <laughs> doing a nice little bit of mining here for us. Maybe they'll uh, discover some compacted steel or something. That could be cool. I wonder what's going to happen when you bust through this piece here. Okay, now... Now you're going to attack. Alright. Alright. That's cool. Huh, that's actually fine. Okay, we've got all the turrets here operational now. Jay is going to haul some rice. Alright. Alright, so let's get people set up. Uh, you guys are all armed. You get out there, but who was the brawler? It's Fox plus Raven. You can go sit back here, or actually sit right there. Um... Travis is eating a meal. All right, let's let him eat his meal and then we'll bring him out as well. Um, you know, maybe I shouldn't have Travis out there because ideally we maybe want other people to do the fighting. But I think it's going to be all right. I think we... Because we're actually prepared... Okay, you're destroying another wall. Because we're actually prepared for this raid, I believe we should be able to take care of it pretty handily we'll get jack to actually come up oh you're gonna come through you're gonna try and come through somewhere else you're gonna try and come through somewhere else all right we need you guys up then and out here and out here okay sass is gonna come through this area it wouldn't be the worst if they bust through here <sighs> All right. I'm thinking some of these guys are coming in now because we're a little bit closer. Um, and this area is like open. All right, let's let's move like over here. Okay. All right. Yeah, let's just sit here. Let's just sit here. Move back a bit. Oh, that was a... Alright, we should... If we kill like one or two more, we should be okay. Is Travis burning? Don't know. I'm okay with him getting out of here though, to be honest. And there we go, they're fleeing. They're fleeing. All right. Fox, get out here. This is exactly why I have you in this position. All right. Is there anyone we really want here? Green Thumb Night Owl. You could be all right. Green Thumb Pretty. You could also be not too bad. Um, you're not amazing, but you do have that helmet. And, yeah, you're okay-ish. I guess first off, we could try and melee Margaret. And then from there, we could consider going, yeah, for Gizmo. These two guys are not too bad, so that's actually potentially a decent idea. Travis, it's time to start capturing some people. Here we have Green Thumb Nudist Hard Worker. That's pretty good. Incapable of social. All right, you're going to be first. Death in 3.2 hours, left leg torn off. Okay. Maybe we don't want to go for that. Can we save him in 3.2 hours? We maybe can. We maybe can. And then we could give him a peg leg. Yeah, he's not so bad a character. Um, Pavel. Okay. Injuries aren't quite as bad. You are a masochist. And a prostophobe. And an ascetic. 
but you can't dumb labor you can cook you can cook and you can mine yeah you would have jobs if we if we got you you would have jobs in the colony uh, this guy is dead really soon yeah you're probably not gonna make it even if we tried to get you and you're not absolutely amazing so we're not gonna try for you is that guy dead yeah he's dead you're dead all right let's go for Should we go for Zeef or for Pavel? Um, Travis is going to go for Zeef. And who's another doctor? Dreamer, are you here? Alright. You're going to go for Pavel. Let's actually... Just make sure Travis is... Alright, cool, cool. You guys come there and shoot Cat. Was Cat... Oh, yeah. You killed this dude who had a normal assault rifle, which is completely good. Let's get... No empty spot configured to store it. Wow, okay, we have used all our stockpile space. Cool. This is why you need massive stockpiles. We'll get that done. And I guess for now, we'll just do a little bit of temporary stockpile like there, just so I can grab some stuff if I want it. Um, yeah, so that before it gets too stuffed up and you go kill gizmo a little bit of wall that needs replacing there all right cat got downed gay nude is psychically sensitive incapable of nothing so not a bad character 10 hours for death all right you were gonna grab you were gonna grab M-Ray Capture. Okay, we actually have the potential to get quite a large colony going here in the next little while. Which is going to be pretty damn good for us. Let's do what we're going to do here. Alright, and I am going to babysit our doctors here to make sure that they do the doctoring that they're supposed to. Okay, Travis is going to do it and Dreamer is going to do it. Good job, boys. Let's check our prisoners. 71%, we will do that. 99%. Okay, you're considered guilty. And yeah, you didn't have the worst wounds. And you were an okay-ish character. I think with our food situation, it's probably best if we just release you, to be honest. Yeah. It is probably best if we do that. Let's actually strip you as well. And then... You can finish treating them, please. Even though... Oh, Emray collapsed? Emray collapsed. Death in four hours. Oh, not so good. Not so good. Not so good. All right, all right, all right. Uh, let me do a colony health check here as well. 15 hours. Four hours we knew about. Okay. All right. So we need really our best doctor which is Travis, to probably try and save... Yeah, Pavel, you're in no immediate danger. All right, Dreamer, you can rescue Emray. Thankfully, his bedroom's right here. Hopefully, he can get that doctoring done. This is going to be really tight, like really, really tight. Okay. 
Now tend. All right. No, 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 no. We we won't use tending to Emray. Why are you going? All right. We're just going to say Doctor Care. Uh, already doctoring. Okay. Cool. Yep. Okay. Uh, but why are you going over here? So you're going to you're going to grab Glitter World Med, Emray, uh, Health. Ah. Oh. Okay, I was probably looking at another character there or something. All right. Uh, reset, tending to Emray and doing it straight away. Are we going to be able to save Emray's life? Three point two hours. Okay, we are. We are. Yeah, with each wound there, he's patching him up fairly decently. And you've just gone into a daze, Dreamer. Yeah, good work, Dreamer. Alright. Travis. 4.3 hours. Alright, I'll let you finish this one wound here that you're treating, Trav. And then I'm going to force you to now tend to Emray. And I need to take a look here. Do I have anyone else who can doctor in a pinch? Uh, Lim Hansen can. All right, Lim Hansen, let's get you to go tend to whoever. Uh, and once again, let's do colony check. Um, okay, Lim Hansen actually needs... Oh, yeah. Uh, let's go to our medical tab here and just... Set all the people for the things. Alright. Yeah, we're really going to have to babysit this here. Alright. Emray has an infection. So, Emray, I'm turning your bed rest on. Stay in bed. Cat uh, is still here. And yeah, he's going to die. Which is okay. You're still in need of some treating. And you, but you're not in any immediate danger. You may get an infection, but there's not much we can do about that. Is there anyone else who can help with doctoring? A three is okay-ish. Alright. Jack is going to help with... Well, okay, I'm going to babysit Jack's doctoring. When he's treated, I'm going to wake him up and get him to treat probably Lim Hansen. Yeah. Oh, I should have maybe stripped that guy while he was... um. Oh, Lim Hansen just collapsed. Lim Hansen just collapsed. You were pretty well treated. Emray is no longer really in any danger. We'll let Travis finish this one thing here, which is actually enough to completely treat him. Now we'll rescue Lim Hansen. Golly, we are really juggling things here. All right. Yeah, 1.8 hours. That arm was uh, already like that. So that's not a fresh wound. All right, let's get you treated, and we will be able to save your life. We have friendlies arriving. Uh, oh, we have friendlies arriving. Okay, so, and we do have the um, poison ship. Is there anyone nearby? Oh, did I just leave you sitting out here, like, the whole time? I did. <laughs> I did. I did. Urgently hungry, very tired. Yeah, you're probably going to go... Super berserk very quickly. Uh, kind of too much stuff happening all at once there. And uh, we lost track of it slightly. Oh yeah, we did blow up that as well. Uh, Alright, Lim Hansen got treated. Now Travis actually still needs to be treated. Tend to yourself please, Travis. All right, and then I think that's going to be everyone treated. Oh, Manhunter Pack, but we've got friendlies around. So this is okay. Yeah, Dreamer's in a... Uh, 
a psychotic state. I don't think we'll like arrest him to get rid of that. You probably get infected here, but we could probably deal with that. So I guess that's okay. For now, I'm actually just going to go into bed rest here and turn it on for everybody because I don't want to have to micromanage that. But right now, there are a lot of people who need bed rest. So if they need to take it, they should do that. You'll go on a rest and yeah, your health. You didn't get helped out at all, but these aren't urgent. It doesn't really matter if they don't get treated. Jack's up and about. And Jay needs to be treated. Okay. Um, is there anyone else who could deal with that? Yeah, Jack could. Okay. Once you've had that meal, Jack, I'm going to get you to tend to Jay. Yep. All right, and let's take a look at this Manhunter pack. It's a Manhunting pack of emus. Pretty big one. There's our friendlies there. What we should try and do is get the door here closed. I don't know if we can do that though. Uh, we have the power flicked on, but it's not connected currently. Because we lost this connection here, and that's literally the only one at the moment. We do need to rectify that. We should probably look at connecting. Well, we can't connect through there. So we should set up our other connection running in, in this way soon. So that this sort of thing can't happen again. One of our prisoners got an infection. Yeah. So some of those guys still need treating. Uh, and a hair self-tamed. Alright, let's just see what happens with this Manhunter pack. I think it's going to be okay with our friendlies here helping us out. Here they come. Okay. Yeah, this is going to be this is going to be fine. <laughs> uh, the friendlies are fleeing, but the emus will probably still aggro on them. Yeah, they will still aggro on them. And will that be enough to? Uh... Yeah, they're going to get out. All right. So what I really need to do is get this door here closed. Beardy, you can't, yeah, you can. So let's, wait. Okay. Unforbid that. Is there anything else sitting there? There's another character there. All right. Beardy, come down. And, well, haul that, I guess. All right. The emus are on their way back. And let's select this door here as soon as we can and not set it to be held open. All right. Um, haul that person. Haul that person. And now the door is clear. Come inside. And I guess we will restrict everyone inside the base. Huh, which actually, well, it does include this little area here. We'll just have to kind of watch that. And probably these emus, we let them get taken care of by toxic fallout. We did have a bunch of guys out here <laughs> get downed. Annoying voice, volatile, trigger happy pessimist, psychically sensitive, steadfast. Fast walker, abrasive, lazy. Yeah, no one's here like absolutely incredible. I have to grab you. But yeah, there's... Yeah, this guy's okay like with his um, skills and stuff and his abilities. He's quite good. And this guy's not bad with his traits. Can't do... Oh, <laughs> but he can't. his skills are just terrible. So we wouldn't pick him up. 
Um, yeah, you're okay-ish. Okay, yeah, not really. Yeah, all right, there's no one there we'd really want to grab. And I don't think anyone else... Yeah, no one else got... downed. Cool. Um, what tribe, or what Outlander group were these guys from, though? I just want to take note of that mentally. You were from... Oh. A Resba. Okay. Cool, cool. Alright, looks like Dreamer is taking care of some of the pris... Oh no, Dreamer's not taking... Well, who do I hear? So Lim Hansen is still treating... Jack. Oh, and Jay is now collapsed. Okay. Could I force Travis to do that? Hmm. Not without risking him going absolutely bonkers. Emre, I believe you can, Doctor. Yes, you can. Yeah, you would probably go bonkers as well, but if we fixed your starving, that wouldn't be too bad. Beardy, go and feed them, please. Yeah, Dream has chosen a bad time to be wandering psychotically. Especially because we need the doctoring happening right now. If we can get through this... <laughs> you're sleeping, apparently. Uh... Oh, no, he's not. I guess that was just a bad thought of some other kind. Yeah, but if we can get through this without any of these guys dying, and hopefully without our prisoners dying here as well... Oh, the muffalo just gave birth. To a female! Great work. Great work. Yeah, but if we can get through this, we're gonna be in a pretty damn good position. For real. You need to rescue. Um, and we're going to have the ability to get up quite a large colony. Which is going to be really good for us. I'm going to unforbid another stove. Because we're really going to need that. Uh, we're already quite low on food as it is. What I probably... Oh, it's the, the main thing. The main thing is this. Yeah. And we can't really go out here to get this done without killing these guys. We're going to have to go out and actually kill these emus, which is okay. We can kill this many emus. We'll just have to give, uh, give our colonists a minute here and let this situation kind of sort itself out. All right, I'll let you repair that. And then I'm actually going to forbid... I'm just going to forbid all these doors so that no one runs outside because this area is allowed so it's possible that they could run out and try and do something. Yeah, but we'll just give this situation like just a minute here to settle. I can see the poison ship is already, uh, is already affecting our crops there so we do need to take care of that. But yeah, I want this situation here just to settle a little bit. Just enough for us to uh, feel comfortable enough to send the people out to shoot the emus. Yeah, Lim Hansen's gone berserk. Okay. Yeah, it's because he was starving. I probably should have let him... Oh, Major... Okay, you're going to maybe need some medicine. Oh, there is so much stuff to be doing here. Okay, you are going to tend to Jay. Dreamer is <laughs> wandering psychotically. Emray. Who can I get to take care of Lim Hansen? Could Fox plus Raven do it? Not really. 
Not really. <laughs> Alright, maybe Travis has to do it. Alright, let's go here. Okay, you're going to attack Dreamer, which is actually not bad. Dreamer, hit him back. There you go. Alright. This is going to work out. Travis probably can't get into the room, actually. Oh, he can. Alright. Alright, let's... Not kill Lim Hansen, just down him, and... Then hopefully, yeah. Alright, cool. You can tend to J, which does need to happen. We'll keep an eye on these infections, and possibly use some medicine there. We should get herbal meds happening as well. We really should. There's a lot of things that we need to do. And a lot of things that we can, that we can get happening because we now have the manpower to take care of it. We just need to get through this, hopefully, without any of these guys dying. We still got meals around. Yeah. Oh, and Emre's just got up and then collapsed. All right. Emre's actually probably going to be alright there. Yeah, he's going to be okay. How's Dreamer doing? Dreamer isn't actually <laughs> infected or anything at all. And he's just collapsed due to exhaustion, but he is still in psychosis, apparently. Let's unforbid everything. I uh, know there's a bunch of, yeah, 38 things that needed taken care of. Alright. Did we take care of all our stuff here? You aren't... S oh no, you are completely taken care of. Alright. Yeah, Dreamer is not taken care of, but we can't really do that. Emre is taken care of. Does need rescuing, but whatever. Oh, and Jackmon has a major infection... That really needs treating now. Alright. Who could do it? I could get you to tend to yourself. Um. Alright. I will get you to tend to yourself. Why can't I get you to do it? unpause it and just see if that helps um okay i can't get you to do it all right travis get up and tend to jack and don't go crazy he's actually not too bad his mood's going to improve who's binging on wake up fox plus raven is binging on wake up that's okay and you did get your Thing treated there. Okay, we're really, we're really just gonna have to keep an eye on these. Okay. Yeah, so Jay's immunity is gonna be okay. You're gonna be okay. You may be okay. Immunity 82. Oh, Emre's got issues. Emre's got issues. Rescue. And you know what? We're going to use Glitter World Med. Yeah, I don't think... I don't think... Because we can't treat that yet. When will it need tending? Oh, very soon. Okay, one... Yeah, very, very soon. So one round of glitter world meds we're going to use here and hopefully that's going to be enough to save your life we've got 97 all right that needs tending right now travis let's do it we're going to go all out for trying to save emray's life here yeah we're going to go all out for trying to save emray's life no, we didn't make it. We didn't make it. So we have lost Emre. 
which was not ideal. But it is what it is. It's not going to be great for our moods either. Everyone's in a pretty bad mood right now and just having someone die is not going to help with that. We do have a sarcophagus which we will bury you in. What's Travis doing? You're going to tend. Oh, and one of our prisoners died as well. Yeah, so your infections probably got to you there. 87. Yeah, I guess it was the infections. I'm not really sure. Yeah, and you actually still haven't been fully treated. So Travis is getting to the rest of that. Man. Man. A lot of things going on right now. Oh, and now we're like really low on food. Really, really low on food. Okay. Okay, how many people could I get to go and shoot some emus? Travis could. <laughs> Travis could. Yeah, Travis is literally the only one who could. And we can't turn the guns on. Oh, man. Alright, Trav. Alright, Trav. Let's see what we can do here. Yeah, you're going to get too close. Yeah, going to get too close. How close are these guys with toxic fallout? Not close at all. Really not close at all. Yeah. And they're probably spending a bit of time under cover in this area as well. Our battery also has no power left, of course. So we can't, like, go and, like, turn these couple of turrets on by using the battery. <sighs> We're just going to have to let this go. And just see if... If we can get through this with, um, without losing too many more colonists.